So at the University of Tennessee, they're putting out these pamphlets in fraternities around the university. To me, it's a direct attack, a war on Uber and Lyft drivers. And I'm disappointed if college kids or university students of today display this type of shocking behavior, right? Because their future does not look bright if this is how they handle things. So read this, my friends. Get free rides by putting your Uber and Lyft drivers on blast. Okay, firstly, I don't think the kids should have ever made it to college or university writing like that. But anyway, number one, always rate one star. Always comment on the car, smelled, driver was reckless, speeded, ran a red light. It's basically encouraging other students, right, to act in this fashion after a trip so that they don't have to, or their cheap ass doesn't have to pay for the trip, right? So my answer to Uber drivers is simple, and I'm going to read you all the reasons that they put on this pamphlet. My answer is simple to Uber drivers. Don't attend their trips, right? And the, the complaint from drivers that I've heard from this university in Tennessee is that these kids um, insist that more than four people get in the car and Uber drivers have to decline them. So this is like a retaliation, right? This is how they behave in return. Number three, make sue, make sue. They don't T have a dash cam cause they can hit you back and have you cut. Dude, that's ghetto. If you got trash, put it on the seat or floor and take a pic. Tell them the driver, the drive talked um, religion or politics and offended you even after you, even after you asked them to stop. Jesus. Tell them the driver smelled horrible and could not speak English. Tell THM. See, that's, that's the lazy texting um, behavior, right? Can't even put that extra little letter in there, right? Tell them the driver smelled horrible and could not speak English. Tell them the driver took you out of the way. They never follow the app's directions, so you got your money back you money back, use a friend's account and have them show they never took the ride because Geo never left campus, you know, the, the GPS. I'm sure this is a disgruntled or a few disgruntled Uber and Lyft drivers lashing back and, and gluing this all over the university. But I'm going to bring this to the University of Tennessee's attention. Um, they should be grateful that drivers drive their students in and out of the college. College students should be grateful that drivers often uh, drive them in an intoxicated, drunken state safely back to their campus or fraternity. And college students at universities, colleges, wherever you are, you've got to take a stand on this. Either you support this shit, which has no future, right? And Uber and Lyft, you've got to do something about this, right? Because, um, you know, this stuff here is, is all over the university, hurting these guys, right? And um, I represent the drivers. I don't represent the passengers. So the couple of drivers report this type of behavior to me, I look into it. And if I get pictures and evidence uh, sent to me, right, then I cover it if it's a, if it's a good story. So um, uh, I think this behavior is appalling. And I understand why these drivers are canceling. And in fact, the dry, all of you drivers need to take a stand. Don't go there. Don't drive there. This is how they want to treat you. Show them how it really goes, right? It's on supply and demand. Let them get on their bicycles. Let them walk. But I have no time for a silly written uh, mass distributed 
leaflet all across across the campus and then sadly many college students think it's cool and funny right and they start adopting here one two three four five six seven eight eight ways to abuse the system eight ways to screw over the driver eight ways to uh, cost a, a driver a trip but again we're one step ahead of you my friends and we'll outsmart you every step of the way and guess how you're going to get back from the pub next time? Guess how you're going to get to college? You're going to walk or you're going to cycle there. End of story. So take the shit down. University of Tennessee, take a strong stand against this. Uber, take a strong stand against this because this is not how we drivers get treated. Thank you.